thanks for tuning in. I am going to review this brand new E2 Rollerblade Hybrid Skate, which is essentially a fitness skate combined with a full speed skate. And that's pretty interesting, as you might know, I'm not a big fan of semi-speed skates because you can't really mix the stiff carbon and then having a taller boot because that goes against the whole point because you're losing that mobility that you would get if you have a low cut skate. So instead it's just gonna be some uncomfortable mix where you don't get the mobility, so you mess up your technique and it's also uncomfortable because nobody wants to wear carbon all the way up here because then you can't flexion your ankle. This is why Rollerblade made this hybrid E2 skate um, that is a classic fitness skate as you look at it here, but you can detach the upper part of it. So if you look at the lower, the bottom part here, it's a carbon shell, so you get that firm, firm tight grip around your feet that you want when you're out skating. Um, but then when you start out skating, you don't have the angle strength and, and just not the skills yet to be in a low skate, which is why it has this top on it. And the top is a soft, well cushioned cuff, um, which means it's going to be comfortable when you're skating. But as I'll just show you now, whenever you're ready for it, you can take this upper part off. Uh, let me just show how easy that actually is. This is pretty smart because you can start out with one single skate. So many people that either go for speed skates way too early when they're not ready for it because it seems faster, you can go faster. Um, but it's, if you're not technically there, it's just gonna ruin your whole skating experience, which is why you should start out with some quality fitness skates, um, just like these. But instead of buying a new pair of skates, when you're ready for it, you can just take this upper part off and you actually got a pretty solid speed skate. Now this looks a little dumb, but a little bit of Velcro attachment. You got that off and uh, here's the speed skate, which is pretty impressive that they managed to combine that. I've been testing these myself and while well, I come from speed skates, so obviously it's super comfortable with this soft cushion. I'll try and film some close-ups from this so you can see how, how nice it actually is. Um, also, it can go backwards and forward, so it can give you that stability you would want. If you want to lean a little more forward, have some more doors flexion, and then you can gradually get closer to how you want to be as an inline skater, as a speed skater, uh, technically, until you're ready to take it completely off, and then you got skates here, um, which is pretty amazing. And these are basically just standard speed skates. Um, so you really just need one pair of skates going from beginner to experience to really fast. Um, obviously you can always you can always make some upgrades from this skate if you want to go on to the uh, the pro uh, editions. If you want to make it a little lighter and, um, and stiffer, you can do that. But honestly, this is a really great skate and I mean, the looks of it is pretty pretty cool as well. Uh, so I'm a really big fan of these and uh, and no doubt that when I get to my off season, I'll, I'll head out and, and just skate for the fun of it. Um, the standard boot here comes with the, the Hydrogen wheels, uh, 125, a three wheel frame obviously, which is not that bad. Uh, for a lot of skaters that can be difficult to steer because you're pretty far off the ground with the big wheels. So sometimes I'd recommend uh, four times 110 millimeters, but if you start out with the cough here, um, I really think you're, you're well off and you can ease into speed skating and don't go too fast to too go for too much of a challenge too early on. Um, so that was just a little review of this E2 skate, which I'm a big fan of, and you save yourself from buying two pairs of skates and getting readapted to that. So go with fitness or full speed, don't waste time with semi-speed. Trust me, it's not worth the money, it's not worth the time. Thank you for watching this video, I appreciate it. Feel free to hit the like and subscribe to my channel because there's gonna come, come more cool videos soon. See you around.